My name is Josh Hardy. I'm with the Wyoming Highway Patrol and this is Canine Duster. He's an explosives canine that is attached here with us at the Wyoming Capitol and the Governor's Protection Detail. We have one other explosives dog, Scout, along with him. That's two here for the Capitol. In addition to these two dogs, we have 10 other dogs spread out through the state that are narcotic canines. And they range anywhere from up in Sundance clear over to Evanston. These dogs are very special dogs. They're very invaluable to our community. Without them, we wouldn't be able to do a proper job from the explosives canines, uh, protecting the area, making sure there's no explosives in our Capitol buildings and other areas, to our narcotics dogs who make sure that they take off dangerous drugs off our highways in and throughout Wyoming. We train with uh, several other agencies across the state. Here in Cheyenne, we'll train with Laramie County. They have some explosives canines here. We also train with the Air Force here. They have several dogs that we train with. And we try to collaborate on special events like uh, with Cheyenne Frontier Days. Sometimes there's large acts that musical acts that come into Cheyenne and we'll sweep areas like Civic Center where they are. They like to have explosives dogs come, come in and make sure the place is secure. It's becoming more popular all the time, but these canines are, like I said before, so invaluable to the community and to us. And that's, uh, it's a uh, longstanding tradition in the Wyoming Highway Patrol since the late uh, 1990s to the early 2000s is when our canine team started and it continually progresses from there to more and more dogs, like I said, with a total of 12 canines throughout the state now.